Hey everyone, another grocery haul, and this time it's a large one. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, we have another rather large grocery haul that was 120 for grocery pickup, I believe, and then another $60 going in store for a couple of things and I do have a couple of Ibotta items I will try to remember to point out and these pizzas here the palmeros the pepperoni and the four cheese these were on Ibotta I believe a dollar back we have the fudge tracks ice cream the mint chip ice cream and the cookies and cream ice cream. We got the Great Value Mini Deep Dish Pepperoni Pizzas and the Cheese Pizzas. My little one loves these for lunch and she actually eats them. So she's branching out a little bit. Yay! We got 12 slices of the Sharp Cheddar Cheese. A beef smoked sausage, which I have for a recipe this week. And we're going to go back here. Some chips. I have leftover barbecue chicken from last night, and I'm going to use those for barbecue nachos. I got two containers of this whipped chocolate Duncan Hines frosting to go with yellow birthday cake mix and then for my little I got these to decorate the cake with just a happy birthday and then the Valentine's Day sprinkles which we can still use for Valentine's Day and I also got her a kinder egg because she loves these and I love these jello snacks for just a little evening snack and they are very inexpensive we got some of my husband's favorite coffee almonds that me and my oldest one like so happy to see they come in a larger size now because it's a great snack more of my bangs I got the power punch the Bangster Berry and the Cherry Blade Limeade. And back here I got some celery for a recipe with the smoked sausage. The Fiesta Blend Cheese. Lettuce for tacos and nachos. And the Fiesta Blend Cheese also for tacos and nachos and whatever else throughout the week. Some sour cream for the nachos and tacos and of course tomatoes some extra creamy whipped topping just to have on hand for jello berries coffee white chocolate mocha coffee creamer for my oldest she wanted to try that one we were completely out of eggs so I got some organic Cage free or Walmart brand large eggs. The Progresso Farmer's Market Roasted Garlic Tomato Sauce. Some of these removable picture holders. The big 12 pack. This was my substitution. We got, I ordered the Paw Patrol mac and cheese cups and then I got the triple cheese which my little one was okay with surprisingly thank goodness my oldest one wanted some more of these noodle cups because she really likes these I got the teriyaki chicken flavor the Korean barbecue and the fiery beef flavor let's see I got some red kidney beans because I'm going to try out red beans and rice which is what the other two things were for because I've not had it and it sounded 
a recipe off of um, Lemonade Mom's Vanessa's channel. I'm going to try that because she did a recipe with this and it looked really good. Two of these round nonstick cake pans for the cake mix. So I decided to go ahead and replace these because mine look pretty beat up. So they were very inexpensive, so I replaced them. A cornbread mix, some jasmine rice, and I will probably also make some cauliflower rice with that. Some baked mix snacks. I figured this was a little bit better than just the regular potato chips. Back here to the non-food items. I believe I got all the food items. So we got water filters because we're in need of some. Shelf liners in the pretty Piner Woman. Some polyurethane and some metallic rubbed bronze spray paint compactor bags because we are completely out uh, some suckers which is already broken into as you can see and some purex crystals which is also on and I bought a rebate so I believe that is it and I am doing a Sam's Club shop today so it should be a smaller one so I'll show you what I got in a bit hey everybody this is a Sam's Club haul the or total I believe was a hundred and sixty six dollars with tax and I'll show you what I got all right first off forgot to mention the water from Walmart I always usually pick up at least one of these and from Sam's the Powerade zero sugar white vinegar because I use this in cleaning and in laundry as fabric softener and up here on the stove we have white bread the nature's own white wheat bread that's what everybody in the house seems to prefer so that's what I get then more eggs the 24 count organic free-range large brown eggs and we got several bags of vegetables we have the broccoli Normandy blend blend of broccoli florets cauliflower florets orange and yellow carrots the regular black green florets and the rice cauliflower so we used to do go through about a bag of each of those a month back here is a little treat this Yamalo baking mermaid and unicorn cookie kit. It's got two sugar cookie kits. Make a unicorn cookie and a mermaid cookie. My favorite, Chef Shammy garlic butter. I put on the vegetables. Two pounds of strawberries. They looked really good. The two good, good for you yogurt. Six vanilla, six strawberry. This is my favorite yogurt. And my youngest one likes the strawberry. So, win-win, in my opinion. For non-food items, I got a pair of these sandals for my little. Yes, size 11. I think she wears a size 10 right now. But these fit in the store. And... That will be good for the summer because she does not have a pair of sandals for the summer yet. <sighs> Hand sanitizer. Got the little take along packs for everybody to use. Good to hook onto purses, backpacks, keychains, what have you. Set of cups. Back to snacks. We got some pretzel crisp. Because my youngest one wanted pretzels and that's the one she wanted along with Cheetos and 
the birthday cake popcorn and it's okay not my favorite but my little one likes it the three pound package of bacon the organic ground beef and the tender and the boneless pork loin chops I usually get two meals out of these I can get three meals out of this and we go through about one of these a month and that is everything I got from Sam's Club like I said it was a smaller haul oh, I think I forgot bananas yeah, got banana. all right I'll talk to you guys next week Bye.